Hey champions, I hope that you are doing wonderful. Well, there is an important update for UG NEET aspirants who have registered themselves to the KEA portal. So, we all know that the round 1 allotment has come. If you do not know, you, it's still there is time, okay? The allotment has come, it's there in their official website, that is KEA portal. Now, there are few things that you should be taking care of after the allotment, which is why I am here. I want to tell you all the schedule regarding what is there after round one allotment after you are allotted with the seed what you should be doing what is the schedule that is being released by the kea so let's see it one by one first thing you are given a chance you are given a time period to fix your choices what do you mean by choices children there are four choices choice one choice two choice three and choice four choice one simply means you are okay with the allotted college you want to go ahead with this okay choice two means accept an upgrade where you're okay with this but you still want to see what you could get in the next round that is choice two. Choice three means you want to reject this and you want to upgrade. You just don't want the seat at all. You're rejecting the offer and now you're going for the next round. Okay. Last one is choice four. That means withdrawal. So withdrawal as in you don't want to participate in the whole process. You're just withdrawing yourself from the whole process. Okay. So this is a simplification of choice one, choice two, choice three and choice four. So during this time, that is from 11 a.m. on 31st of August 2024, 3rd of September 2024, that is tomorrow, you are given a time to fix your choices. Whatever choices you want to get into, you are just uh, locking the choice. Okay, you are just choosing what you want to choose. Yeah, and this obviously should be done with the help of your parents as well. They could help you really well. Now remember, it's only until 11.59 tomorrow. Going ahead, suppose you, are, you clicked on choice 1 and choice 2 either one okay if you're going ahead with choice one or you are going ahead with choice two what do these children have to do so payment of the fees has to be done if you're clicking on choice one or if you're going ahead with choice two what do you need to do you need to pay the fees now this time period is very again very much crucial it's from 1 p.m 31st of august and it will go up to 4th september 2024 4 p.m 4th September 2024, 4 p.m. Only until then you have the time to pay the fees. This is for choice 1, children who have went for choice 1 as well as choice 2. Okay. Going ahead, what do we have? Deposition of original documents at the KEA, Bangalore, in person along with two sets of attested photocopies of what? Of all the documents only for choice 1 fee paid candidates. So this is not for choice 2 candidates. This is for choice 1 fee paid. Those who have already done the fee payment and now they are over here. They have to deposit their original documents. Okay, along with what? Two sets of attested photocopies of all the documents. Now there's an important thing over here. Okay, which is very, very, very confusing. I could zoom it and show it to you. Who should submit the original documents? Please read the instructions. So there is not like everyone who went for choice one has to submit the documents, submit the original documents. So let's see who can, who has to, what say, submit the original documents. It's there in another PDF that is given by them itself. Okay, so over here they have written the notice that has come. Post seat allotment procedure to candidates who have exercised choice one. That means who have picked choice one. Okay. The candidates who have been allotted government medical seat. This is very, very, very important. I'll highlight it and show it to you if you want. But yes, this is very much important. Mm. Okay. Who got government medical seat in what? Private medical colleges and private medical seat in private medical colleges. Okay. For those children only, they have to go to the KEA place and put down their documents, give their original documents. So as you saw here, the children who are done with the fee payment and uh, they are in choice, they, are cho uh, they chose the choice one thing, that is they are ready with the allotment, they are okay with it, they want to go ahead with the college. For them, they have to put down the original documents, but it's not for all, it's generally for these people. Who are these people? Children who have got government medical seat in a private medical college or who have got private, private medical seat in the private medical college. Only then you have to go and submit the original documents. So in this PDF itself, there is one more thing. Just a second. Okay. In this PDF itself, who should not submit the originals at the KEA Bangalore? Okay. So for children from NEET aspirants, I'm telling you that the candidates who have been allotted medical seat in government medical colleges. Okay. They are getting a medical seat in the government medical colleges need not submit the originals at the KEA Bangalore. But 
they must compulsorily submit the original documents at the respective college along with compulsory rural service bond at the time of admission so at the time of admission you have to give your original documents as well as a uh, compulsory rural ser uh, service bond as well okay so for you that is children who got government medical colleges seats okay medical seat you do not need to submit your original documents as of now even if you went ahead with choice one this is only for the other children okay i hope this is done now for the children who are going ahead with this who have to put down the original documents the time period is from 2nd of uh, september 2024 that is today to 4th of september 2024 the timings are between 10 30 am to 4 pm 10 30 am to 4 pm again 4th of september okay now read the instructions for the deposition of original documents that is what i read now going ahead downloading of admission order only by choice one so now so suppose a child didn't have to go through this particular step okay because you got a government uh, you got a medical seat in government medical college still the next step is applicable for you as well downloading of admission order only by choice one so the, whoever had this choice one thing they have to download the admission order now after the payment and after deposition of original documents so i know that you might have not uh, deposited the original documents it's for the children i'm talking about the children who got government medical college seats okay so for them obviously you did not uh, what say you do not do this particular step so for you also you will be getting getting the admission order if you're done with the fee payment and for the other children who have submitted the original documents then obviously you can also do the download the admission order now going ahead last date for reporting okay and what is the time period it's from 2nd september and it goes up to 5th of september 2024 so only during this period you can download the admission order going ahead last date for reporting at the allotted medical dental college for choice one candidates only this is not for choice two this is for choice one because choice two candidates obviously went for upgrade except an upgrade so for choice one candidates the last date of reporting at the medical college or dental college with one set of attested photocopies as per the verification slip whatever attested photocopies were needed they all should be there okay and the report last date for reporting will be 5th of september before 5 30 pm so do not forget to go and report if you're not reporting probably you lose a seat so do not do not do that okay so i suppose that all these steps that are given over here it is understood by you if you want to know more about things okay you still can go to the kea website over here if you click on admissions there are three things there are so many things you can click on the third one that is ug need and over here you will be getting to see lot of notifications that comes from their end so over here as you can see there is first round seat allotment list for medical okay if you click on that you will get the list of all the uh, what say allotment same thing for dental same thing for ayush everything has come up in there so do not miss any chance over here look up if you want any information but obviously we will be there we will be giving out you all information in all our possible ways yeah so suppose this is done yeah do not forget to subscribe the channel and have a really good day do not worry about anything everything is going to get sorted yeah bye bye take care